Welcome back, Travelers. It's Sada Havoc here, and we are back playing a little Project Ozone 2 on Kappa Mode. And today, we are going to do some traveling. That's right. I'm going to try to knock out two planets, not just one, but two. In today's episode, we're going to hurry up and get to Mercury, and I can finally, finally finish Alpha. It's been so long. All I need is that Mercury ingot. That's all I need. So, yes, here's where we're at. Um, first thing is we're actually going to go create a portal real quick. Um, as you can see, I now have a decent amount of cobblestone getting going. I took the design that I rechanged it and, uh, inverted it again. And let me tell you, it took me a while to get all these blaze rods. I mean, not too long. Cause I mean, what, what, uh, four per, so 16, that's uh one stack, almost two stacks, a stack and 48 to get all the blaze rods for that. Cause I still don't have any blaze essence. So I wasn't able to make them that way. Um, but yeah, it seems to be pumping out pretty good, but let me show you. I don't know if you guys noticed last time when I talked about, uh, the deep dark portal that I wanted to make the deep dark portal here, it takes one bedrock four octuple cobblestone and four bedrockium. Okay. So I thought when I looked at bedrock and it was, you know, uh, nine of these and nine of these are made from nine bedrockium ingots. I thought that one bedrock ingot was one octopal cobblestone melted down. It's not, it's just one of those. So I only need nine for the bedrock. <clears throat> I need four more for the bedrock. Ium. So basically I need 17 total and I've got way more than that. I got seven on me, probably another 20 some odd in my system. Cause I was trying to save up to like the 90 some odd that I thought I needed. But I also in the process of working on this happened to find this little guy and I tested it out in, um, the my my creative world to see how it worked this little cobblestone framework this little guy is awesome super awesome basically you make this little machine frame which is really really simple it's just dark stone electrical steel and i think that's the only recipe yeah and then you add on whatever you want like you can make uh machine frameworks and then the cobble framework controller and, or you can just do the cobble framework controller, right? And that's all I really want for is the cobble. Although I think I might need the tanks for water and lava. I'm not hundred percent sure about that. Um, but was oh, there a difference? That's his cobble framework. They all say the same thing. They're all the same ID number. I don't know. But anyways, those pump out a ton of cobble. Yes, a ton of cobble. So we're going to be going ahead and making that bad boy in just a little bit. But I'm going to show you, I have been busy working, getting ready for today's episode. And I'm going to warp there right now, but I'm going to take a little pause because, well, you'll see why. So like I said, I've been doing some work and that work is this. I have cleared out like this entire area. I, I got back on and I was really, really excited to play. But the problem was, I just wasn't feeling the build build anymore. Wait, is this a different land, like right there? No, that's still swamp land. That's still swamp land. It's a slime chunk, though. That's cool. Um, I just wasn't quite feeling it anymore. And you know, it's kind of like when you start up a new map or anything like that. You just your, your creative juices are just a little bit different than they, uh, you know, they were the last time you kind of played and stuff like that. And so, you know what? Let me do this over in the middle because I want to expose what we've done. All right, so you know your 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 feeling for stuff gets a little bit different, and you want to kind of change things up. You change your build, and voila, this is the new build. Uh, it took me not too long, day or so, uh, to get this all done. Uh, just dedicated to just working on this, but I'm kind of digging on it. It's I don't know, I I like it. I'm really kind of feeling for it. I uh, right now, everything that I already had, I've kind of built on the platforms and stuff like that. And the platforms just kind of stretch around and do their own thing. I did not realize how many storage drawers I had used until I started stacking them. And this bad boy, I think is 12 tall, 13 tall, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten tall, four wide, and uh, nine, or sorry, yeah, four wide and nine long. I had a lot of storage drawers. I didn't realize that. And then up here, I've got my portals all set up and I kind of did a fun way of the end portal on end stone, the nether portal on the nether stone, nether rack. Like this is the regular nether portal. And then the nether brick is actually the roof. Get it? Cause bricks on the roof. I don't know. That was my logic. Uh, holy stone for aether. Um, this I did clear glass because I just, I always think of the last millennium is like a, a true void. I don't feel like this is a void to me. I don't know. Uh, the, the hay is for my farm because that's where the mob farms at. Uh, this Galactic Crafter is from Mars. 
This is from uh, the 1997 world. I forget what that's called. Uh, Aroma's 1997 world. Uh, this is the moon. And then this one is uh, Erebus. So it's on the Erebus stone. And then I've got room for two more up here. And then I'll probably just do another platform up again once we get more planets. So that's kind of where we're at. I've, I've been going kind of crazy with this. So anyways, I'm going to finish clearing out this dirt. And then we are going to get going on today's episode. So we'll be right back. All right, guys, so we're back. I've got all the grass picked up, and uh, this was the other one thing I wanted to talk about. I knew that I was going to have this floating bedrock over here, and that kind of gave me an idea to do floating islands around this main area. So, like, as I get further into Batania, and I need to start making more Batania things, I can kind of make a little Batania world over there. Uh, if you guys have ever seen my um, Sky Factory 3 series, I started doing a cool little build like that. But I think I'm just going to do more open plains area um, just in you know, in general, not actual builds per se, but building the, the islands themselves. Um, and then maybe like an uh, immersive engineering, because I do want to kind of get all the main things from each of the main mods built. And maybe we'll just have a whole bunch of floating islands around. We'll see how that goes. I'm not exactly sure. But the first thing I do want to do is get the uh, portal to the deep dark made. We're not going to spend any time there. I just want to get it made. Um, you know, accomplishments and all. You guys know how I am with doing achievements and stuff. So I need to go make bedrock. I need octuple. Okay. Um, so I need octuple contempt. Okay. Got that. And wait, are those octuple? Those are octuple. Why didn't you stack? Okay. And my redstone furnace is right over here. So I'm going to need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine for the bedrock. And then I need probably four more for the ingots and then the frame and four of those. Okay, so we're good. Oh, those things slow you down. I totally forgot about that. Uh, so let's craft these guys up real quick. Uh, do I have any bedrock? I think I, I've got one. Oh yeah, because I made the bedrock aim drum, that's right. All right, so we're gonna break you down into nine ingots. We're gonna go ahead and craft you up into a piece of bedrock. And we've got you. Oh, wait, I need all you guys. Get back here. All right, so bedrock. One, two, three, four. And the octuple cobblestone. One, two, three, four. Now, I don't know how long this is going to take. Wow, that zoom in is like crazy. Um, where is my QED? Over there. I also just learned this the other day. Every time you look at the QED, the name changes. Quad Erat Demonstratum. And then if you like come back a little later, every time you turn like quantum enrichment device, if you look at the parentheses up top where it says QED, like it changes its name constantly whenever you're not looking at it on, on the concept of quantum physics and uh, quark electron detect. I don't know. I just thought that was kind of fun. I don't know if you guys are as entertained by the silliness like I am, but oh, that was super fast. All right, cool. So we, I'll probably put it over here just for right now. We're not going to go there. But I'm going to put it here for right now, just so when we do, then I can make another um, uh, portal, like pestle for it. And yes, so anyways, moving on. Today, 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 we are heading off to Venus and Mercury, like I said. And I have pretty much everything I need so far. Um, as you can see, I've made a whole bunch of these heavy-duty plates already. Uh, I think there's some in here. Yep. And yeah. And so we should have pretty much everything we need. Um, let's check out our tier three rocket. And actually I'm gonna have to make the tier three and tier four, I believe, because I believe Mercury is a tier four. So tier three rocket is relatively simple. We've got all this, okay. Um, I need to make one of these. I'm gonna need these. I'm gonna need like probably six of these because I'm gonna need two rocket boosters and then I'm gonna need four of the fuel tanks. So we need to make six of these guys. One, two, three, four, five, six. I hope I'm doing my math right as I'm saying all this stuff. Uh, Cause I'm gonna need them for this thing too, if I remember correctly. Yes. Now I should be able to make that. Um, compressed tin, I don't have any compressed tin. How, how do I not have compressed tin? Oh, there it is. I don't know what was going on there. All right, so I'm gonna need one, two. Um, oh, I need to fill these up. Three, four for the two rockets that I'm gonna need. And uh, what else do I need? Um, I'm gonna need like six of these. 
I know I need one for each rocket, and then I'm gonna need two, four, yes, yeah, so I'm gonna need six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. And these guys should be simple, just like that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got you. And I've got all those. This guy, I'm gonna need two of these. Uh, actually, you know, I'm not gonna say I need two. I'm gonna assume at least one. That's that's what I'm gonna do. I don't know if the tier four is gonna be the same. Um, now I can make this guy. Oh, flint and steel. I probably don't have any steel in there. I've reset all this up so it's working a lot more efficiently now. Let me just grab a whole stack. There we go. I never have steel in here because I always leave it over there. So. Uh, there we go. So steel goes in there and now I can make my flint and steel as it goes into the system. There we go. And I'm going to need two of these cause we're going to have two boosters to make. And, um, oh, I'm going to need stone because I don't have any of those. So let me make two buttons. One, two, there we go. Now I should be able to make this guy. Once those buttons get in there. Why aren't you making it? I, I've, I just put a whole bunch of heavy plates in. I put those in there. I put those in there. I put that in there. Put those in there. There we go. One, but I don't know if it's going to be the same exact build. So, oh yeah, because it's not going to be the heavy plates. It's probably going to be the other one. So yeah. And then the plates themselves. Okay. So we are rocking and rolling here. Um, I don't know how many. I'll just grab half a stack. But I do need to go over and right here and fill these two guys up because I got to make the boosters. So we'll go ahead and fill you guys up real quick. And lastly, I got to make those rockets now. So uh, tier three, not four, three. And you. And I should have everything. Um, I think I might be missing wool. I think that might be what I'm missing. Uh, wool. Yep, there we go. And so I need some yellow, like so. And there we go. Now I should have everything for those. Once it gets into the system, come on. There we go. One, two. I guess it didn't have to be full, as I'm noticing. Or maybe I had some full ones in there. I don't remember doing extra full ones. Um, okay, so that should be good. We should be able to make our tier three rocket. Let's see. I can't just shift click in. Oh, also it's not the right design. Oh, I can do that. Oh, that's so much faster. Okay, cool. Let us check out our tier three rocket. Oh my God, this thing just, that looks so cool. So much cooler than the old school ones. I mean, don't worry. Don't, I, you're my first and I'll always love you. And you're my first one with little boosters and I'll always love you. But look at this guy. This guy looks so cool. That is awesome. So the one thing I do need to go check is on this, uh, this stuff right here, the thermal padding. This one doesn't give any specifics, but I want to make sure that I don't need a higher level thermal padding before I go. So let's check that out. Um, this is tier two. So the tier two, there you go. Required for Venus and Mercury. I'm glad I checked. So what are we going to need? We're going to need, okay, so 24 of those, and it looks like four pieces of dash. Simple. Um, so if I need 24 of these, and these <coughs> are two each, we're going to need 48 of these and some dash. Uh, let's see how much we have of each. Dash, I don't have any. Let us go make some real quick while we're crafting everything else up. Uh, I went the wrong way. Um, I should have room in all these guys to drop some. Yes, I do. Okay. So you start just pounding away at these guys. Um, take all this stuff out. Like so. Like so. There we go. There we go. I got one more back here I can fill. I'm just doing 16 at a time, well, but 32 in this one, just because I was trying to get them to go as fast as possible. So while we're doing that, we're gonna work on the thermal. I gotta make up, uh, 
this stuff. So I gotta make up these, which means I gotta make up these, which is just wool, cool. Um, how much wool do I have? Yeah, I remember, I didn't have a lot, but I got a whole bunch of cotton now that I grew out, yeah, 6K. So let us do this, make that the recipe, fill it. Why aren't you filling that one? Fill it up, there we go. All right, and let me put all these in here for right now. When I need it, I'll make it, okay. Come on, come on. Man, this is a bit slow. Go, 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 go. It's like a little bit, I don't wanna say laggy, it's not laggy, it's just a little slower than I want it to be. And finally, there we go. Okay, clear you out. And now for these makes wool. That's a little faster. And then I should have plenty of redstone to make those. So much faster than the last time I did this. So, so much faster, okay. And now thermal, I'm making these guys, but I'm actually making these, so I need 48 of these. Oh, tons, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I did that so backwards, but whatever. There we go, 16 of those. Cool. Now let me go grab that dash. Woo, I shot all the way to the top. Hopefully it didn't pump into the other one. It did. It did. Okay, so they're all over here. Cool. There you guys are. What what being in? Um, sixteen of those. Sixteen there, sixteen there. Cool. So they all kind of went this um one of them's still going. Oh, it's probably that last one that I had thirty two in. That'll probably be it. Okay, cool. So now I should be good to make 24 of these. Oh, perfect, I did my numbers perfect, ta-da. And then this with you, there's one. You gotta go back in the system to come back out. <laughs> come on, there we go, there's two. There's three. And there is four, cool. And we should be good for the next two planets with these, so let's just get all the warmer stuff on, cool. This is gonna go in the museum eventually. That'd be cool. And I think we are ready to travel. Let me double check my, my, my stats here. Um, no oxygen remaining there, and a little bit there. Let us, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to fill these up or not. Take these guys out. I don't have an oxygen collector set up right now, so I just gotta do it this way. Oh yeah, and then we'll still have over half a tank, so. Yeah, 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 we're good. We are good. Let me go ahead and put those back into place. Put you back in here, and, oh, no, you into there. And off to Venus we go, oh no, uh, I need a pedestal. Which is, every time I try to find it, I can't. All right, I need two of these. Um, oh, I hate when I do that. Okay, just click it off of this one. Okay, there we go. So I need to make you. Let's just, I'm not gonna use a lot of these, but let's like make 10. That way I don't have to keep making these things. And you, I'm gonna need 42 of them. There, we're good. Now <laughs> let's make the pedestal. One, two, there we go. And I need the charm of dislocation. These are all my old ones that I can no longer bind, which is kind of annoying. Uh, once they're bound once, they're unbindable, so. What am I missing? What am I missing? Ender. Yeah, that's what I'm missing, Ender eyes. We'll just make 10, there we go. And while I'm on this, no, I really can't do that, okay. I was gonna say while I'm on the screen, but I didn't have the draconium available to me, so. One, two, there we go. And let's, uh, oh, there, now you did it, okay. Uh, so this pedestal is gonna go right here, like so. And we are gonna bind this one to right here. Hey, no, it bound it. 
<laughs> it bound it down below me. I'm going to go make another one just because that's going to be annoying. Um, let's just put this one away. <laughs> that'll, that'll super annoy me. Okay, let me back off of this real quick. Oh, come on. There we go. So there we go. Now it's bound here. All right, cool. And then this will go in my pack. So I remember which one's which. Well, it'll say unbound anyways. And then I'll bind this one to Venus. And we're good to go. Hopefully, I think I have fuel going. I think I've got gasoline going over here uh, to the system, right? I do. Cool. So you should be all full up, right? Uh, inventory is F. I'm full on fuel. We are good to go. We are heading to Venus, people. Let's go. I'll see you when we get there. All right, guys, we are inbound to Venus. There's another parachute. What's that parachute? Oh, it's like the chest. Okay. Um, I want to be up on some flat land. Oh, cool. Right in this little crater right here. That's kind of cool. And it looks like I'm going to need to uh, start by fighting. Yep. Hey, back off. I don't want to be messing with y'all. Uh, where's that chest at? Can I get that chest in midair? That would be awesome. Nope. All right. So we're going to get set up here, put our pedestal, kind of get bounced back and forth. And uh, basically, I'm just going to acquire what I need. Thank you. And what is this material? Oh, I didn't make my dev nulls. I need to go do that too. So volcanic rock. All right. So let us get into the hillside here. Oh, lots of lava. Okay, so this is a hotter planet. Oh, stay away. Um, is there going to be a safe place to do this? I don't want to do it out in the open, but it seems like there's a lot of lava on this world. Um, a good place to harvest lava, I guess. Uh, let's try in the volcanic rock area. I mean, you would think the volcanic rocks there is because of lava, but my logic is it dried up, so... All right, I think that's good. Oh, look at this. I'm getting some uh, magma creams, which is nice. All right, there we go. And let me get this set first. So right here, good. Now I can swap these out. So you're gonna go there. I, I want to make sure I put the right one. And you go there, cool. And you're there. And there, and here we go, back to the overworld. All right. And look at that, I'm facing right where I need to to put this bad boy on that pedestal. Oh, look at that, and I've got the stone. Ha! I'm so planned out for this. I totally meant to do that. I really did. Um, yeah, so we'll knock you out real quick, and we'll pop one of these Venus stones in. There we go. Perfect, perfect. And now I need some dev nulls. Um, volcanic rock. All right, so let's make some dev nulls real quick. You right there. I don't know how many I need. I'm gonna take like maybe four with me. I don't know exactly how many I'm gonna need. But let's see. Uh, volcanic. Oops, that's volcanic. Volcanic. There you go. And Venus. We've got stone, subsurface, and surface. Okay, cool. So one, two, three. Hopefully that's all I need. I'm hoping. <coughs> so let's go ahead and make all these. Like so. Because we are gonna mine up. Oh my goodness. <coughs> I just swallowed it and went right down the wrong pipe because we need to go get our Venus uh, metal I'm assuming since you know we had Mars or ingots and you know the asteroid or whatever the, the metal um, meteoric metal iron yes that's the word I'm looking for so I'm figuring it's probably gonna be the similar and we can get some Venus to probably make the tier 4 I, I probably should check as I'm saying all this um, let me check and see what the tier 4 requires Ooh, they're like all fancy colored and stuff. Okay, so yeah, it is heavy duty plates four, which is compressed carbon and heavy duty plates. Compressed carbon comes from carbon ingots, um, carbon ore, 
or can't do anything with the Philosopher's Stone and blocks of carbon. Okay, yeah, so let's go to town on this stuff. Um, we're going to go dig in a different place. Uh, here, you guys have that. Oh, I guess I can't do that. You guys are annoying. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, I should probably mark this on my map. Jay, uh, waypoint, new, uh, Venus spawn, I guess I call it. Save. And let's look at Mars real quick and see if those are still there. Mars dungeon. Let's turn on that one. Oh, that one is on. Um, I don't see it. It's not too far from here, so I should be able to see it. Oh, you know what? It's not visible. Um, yeah, I got to go to Mars and then I need to edit it and make it visible on Venus. And if it, this works, I'll be so happy. I can't scroll down for some reason. It's like it keeps jumping back up. Where's Venus at? Oh, there it is. On. Jupiter on Venus. On something. Cool. Save. Where's the... Ah, there it is. Okay. Hopefully there's a dungeon over there. I, I'm being really, really helpful right now. Because, well, why not be helpful? I don't need slime balls right now. Please be a dungeon over here. Please be a dungeon. If not, I got to go find one. And that's going to take a minute. And so I'm being optimistic that there's a dungeon right here. There's not. So guys, I'm going to go search for a dungeon and I will be right back. Oh, little, little pause here. Oh, there was an explosion somewhere. Um, I just happened to see this as I was going by. There's a cool ca like cavern here. Like there's, this is cool. And that's iron ore. I need to get some of that carbon too, but I just kind of wanted to show you this as I was flying out. Is that carbon or is that coal? That's carbon ore. Cool. So we'll get some of that. Um, but yeah, as I was flying just moments later, I ran into this little village and just kind of wanted to come check it out with you guys. It looks exactly like the villages on the Mars or on the moon. I didn't see any on Mars. Um, I'm surprised it's not all women because aren't women from Venus. And so it should be all female, uh, villagers. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. I have my crossbow in my hand. My bad. I was trying to trade with you. My bad. I'm sorry. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to show you that apparently there's uh, villages on Venus. So anyways, back to looking for our... Are those blaze? Those aren't regular blaze, are they? Evolved blaze. Okay, you stay there. I guess that means they can live on Mars and Venus and stuff. All right, so I'm back and looking for the dungeon and we'll be right back. So after a while, like always, I finally found one. Let me tell you how I don't like searching for ravines on Venus or uh, dungeons because there's a ton of ravines and all the lava pits. And so there's a whole bunch of holes everywhere. And it was rather challenging trying to find this place. But here we are. What? What? That can't be it. That. No, 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 no. Hold up. No, that can't be it. At all. No. <laughs> I was so excited. I finally found it. Um. Oh, okay. Here, there's more. Um. There we go. Okay. I'm a happy camper again. I'm just flying. Just, just avoiding everybody. Anything worthwhile? Mm, I don't know. That's a tic-tac-toe on it, didn't it? Oh, cool. Um, I'm going to collect music discs because I think there's a use for them later. Not sure. Another word I can get any time. Redstone I can get any time. Um, oh, this looks like the room. Oh. Oh, that wasn't much of a fight now, was it? Well, cool. So we got that. I'm going to head back. Well, let's see what's cool. What, what, what cool stuff we got in the chest. Thank you. Get all this XP. Perfect. And the chest is over here. All right, cool. So we'll run in here real quick, get this chest, um, tier four dungeon key. There we go. 
And what do we got? Um, another tic-tac-toe. Don't really need you now. Workbench Rocket 4. Good. Um, you know, I'm going to grab that just because it's something new and different. I like name tags. They're fun. Uh, don't need that. I like unknown dimlets. And, you know, I got one spot left. I'll take the chance. Keeps cool. So I'm going to head back and get the next rock wrapped. And I'm going to do time check and see where we're at on time. Because I got to go collect some carbon and stuff like that too and go back with that. So we are going to go ahead and get this all kind of situated and stuff. And we will decide what we're going to do at that point. So we will be right back. All right, Traveler. So I, I got back. I uh, didn't have enough food, so I had to come back and get some food. So I only got a little bit of the carbon ore. But I realized as I was doing that, we're getting close to that 30-minute mark. And so I thought I would do something that I haven't done in a long time. Something really stupid. We're going to take out some gigantic chance cubes and a full stack of... No, not a full stack. We'll do like 16. There we go. So we'll do 16 regular chance cubes. We're going to head over to an area that I don't care if we destroy... Because I will never forget, even though it's been a very, very long time, I will never forget to not open one of those giant chance cubes anywhere near my base. Um, we are going over here. And we're going to get way, way, way away from our spawn point. And I really need to make a spawn point while I'm here. They're all gone now. Um, there we go. And so we'll turn that guy on. And we are going to travel off into the distance and do some chance cubes to finish up. And then that will lead into uh, Monday's episode, which I am going to try to put them out. Monday and Friday. That is my new thing. Monday and Fridays. I'm going to try to get two out a week. Um, oh, that's kind of just cool that it puts all those down. I actually want to salvage those. I love those. I remember playing with those before. Thank you. And yeah. And so I'm going to try to put two out a week. So this is going out uh, today on... December, what's the day? The 8th? Yes, this will be going up today. And then later on, on Monday, uh, we'll be posting a new episode. That is when we will finally be getting to Mercury, as long as I can find enough carbon, which I don't see why I wouldn't be able to. Oh, could I? Can I claim you? Or like box you up? Or, you know what? I'm, I'm, I don't know why this is even useful, but I'm going to create a little point right here that just is safe. Because. There might be a chance, just I, I'm not even a great chance, just a slight chance. I might be able to collect that, but I'm going to stop picking up all these. There's just chance cubes everywhere. A little meteor over there for applied energistics. I wonder if there's anything useful in those. We'll have to go check those out. I haven't really explored this world. All I did was check out that one little tower at the very beginning, and that was it. So, yes, Mondays and Fridays, um, I'll be trying to get them out at 5 o'clock West Coast time. That's by 8 o'clock East Coast time in the United States. And that way, I think that's a decent time to release. That's when most people are getting home and stuff like that and are watching. I love that sound. Okay, here we go. Inverting 17,781 blocks may take a minute. Uh, there's like obsidian and that was interesting. But we're going to just stick this giant chance cube right on top of the next one. I hear it's still changing down there. All right, here we go. Oh, this could be cool. I'm already liking the looks of this. Oh, it's like a little dome. It's the Thunder Dome, Biznich. Oh, that's awesome. <coughs> we'll have to see what that turns into as it's on top of the other bed of stuff. Now let's check out these other chance cubes. I just lay out a whole bunch of them. Some of these are going to destroy each other. I know that. I've done this before. I ain't new. You know what? Let's open them all at one time. Okay. Tildy doesn't work on that one. Okay. I tried Tildy, but that didn't work. Um. Oh, that's the spider horde, isn't it? Yep. These guys should be dying, but they don't seem to. They're shooting each other. <laughs> Suckers. Get in a fight with each other. That's just stupid. Okay, I can't do that. Um, let me turn my magnet off real quick. All right, they're burning. I don't think the withers burn. I don't know why I'm not getting hit right there, but arrows are falling out of the sky. All right, let's get the rest of these done. Get out of here. Another horde. Oh, there's gas. Are those the gas bat guy? Oh. They're in the Thunderdome. 
That's kind of cool. We'll have to come back and play with that in a little bit. Uh, let's see if we get... I just want to get something cool. I mean, why are all the chance cubes negative? Why are there never any positive ones? Like, seriously. Seriously, guys. You two. You guys are so annoying. All right, there we go. There's never any positive ones. A, a block of lava landed on me. Really? Was that necessary? And I don't even think that's lava. That's like something else. Blazing pyrothium. Nice. Okay. What else you got? I mean, something positive. Oh, it's a TNT on top of a cat. Poor kitty. Poor. Oh, let me get that head. There we go. Oh, more of those. I'll take those. All right. Two more. What? What did that do? Oh, I moved just in time. Oh, that's kind of evil. That's actually really evil. All right, last one. Uh, those items you yours need to be personal. A little personality. I wonder if it just threw it in the blazing pyrothium. I don't know. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys are enjoying the series, and I hope you guys are enjoying that I'm back and making more videos. Like I said, next episode, we are definitely going to be take. It just cleared out my inventory. Oh, what the? Oh, heck no. All my armor, everything. Okay, that's just stupid. Oh, come on. Come on. That's just stupid right there. Give me that. I need my flight back. <laughs> okay, so my inventory wasn't totally full. Okay, cool. All right, looks like I got most of it back. <sighs> that that was just stupid. No more, no more chance cubes. As I have one in my hand. As I have one in my hand, and I say no more chance cubes. Let's do the icosahedron real quick to finish up. But anyways, like I was saying, as we're watching this last one go off, I hope you guys are enjoyed it and I hope you guys want to see more. If you do, please don't hesitate to hit that thumbs up. And if you feel so inclined, you know, you're always free to one arrow or oh, five arrows and a pretty cool bow. Um, please hit that subscribe button if you're new and want to see more uh, stuff uh, uh, like uh, this. So until next time, travelers, y'all know the deal. I am Slider Havoc and I am out of here. Peace.